Hey, what's up, everyone? X Rice with X back again here for the video game pickups. This is episode number 29. This is gonna be entitled 2012 Recap. Um, most of these items I didn't really show in um, video game pickups number 28 because most of these weren't even released yet. So uh, let's go ahead and get started. It's gonna be quick opinion and thoughts of uh, the games I picked up. So let's go ahead and get started. I happen to pick up the Wii Basic set. Um, on launch date, when I say launch date, there are unboxing videos on my channel, so definitely go check them out if you guys want to. Um, but I did happen to pick up the Wii Basic set on launch date. Um, eventually I'm going to end up paying around $900 to $1,000 on the system and games and accessories that came with it. Will it be worth it? Only time will tell. Um, so yeah, let's get to the rest of the stuff here. Halo 4, pick this game on launch date. Um, pick, pick up the season pass with it. Um, haven't really gotten down to playing the campaign too much. Uh, that's because they play all my first person shooter games on the hardest difficulty it comes with. Um, the multiplayer is pretty fun, I love it. Uh, mostly because of the SWAT playlist. Kirby 20th Anniversary, Kirby's Dreamline Collection, I just call it Dream Collection, or Dreamline Collection, not Dream Collection. Um, haven't gotten down to playing it, but I happen to play it. Happen to have played most of the games on here anyways. Um, so yeah. I only opened it because um, it's kind of not really as worth as much as uh, uh, Super Mario All-Stars 25th Anniversary. Super Mario All-Stars, you know, whatever. The, that bundle, as well as um, the Skyward Sword bundle. That's not really, this is not worth as much anymore. Um, you can pretty much go ahead and buy it at GameStop. It's like in stock still. Uh, that's why I pretty much opened it and to listen to the soundtrack. Um, because I was listening to the Skyward Sword soundtrack and that's pretty much why I opened it. Um, Black Ops 2, I picked this game up on launch date. It came, well it didn't come with one, but I donated $5 to the um, in Call of Duty Endowment, which is um, pretty much like a donation thing where veterans finding jobs, it helps them and stuff like that. Um, but they happened to give me a dog tag with it, so definitely check out the video if you guys want to. Uh, but Black Ops 2, this game, the multiplayer was horrible in pretty much the same week when it was la uh, launched. Um, but they actually fixed the multiplayer, which is pretty awesome. They just need to fix the knifing and stuff like that. Like that. You can still launch it, but it's not really accurate. Zombies is pretty fun, though. Uh, I haven't gone down to playing too much of the campaign, though. <clears throat> Batman Arkham City Armored Edition. Haven't gone down to playing it. Why? Because it's still brand new, still sealed. Um, but I did play play a little bit because Yoshi brought over his copy, and um, it was pretty pretty good actually. It's kind of a, a master game, but uh, haven't gone down to playing the full story. I just didn't want to spoil my ex my future experience if I decide to open it. Um, New Super Mario Bros. U. It's kind of similar to Super Mario Bros. 3 and uh, Super Mario World. The only thing I hate about this, my only um, complaint, is where <laughs> you don't have um. You can't carry two items, or yeah, pretty much that. Uh, you know, Super Mario World, you can pick an item. Um, well, okay, I'm not thinking straight. Okay, let's say if you picked up two mushrooms, you get to save one of the mushrooms and stuff like that on the top, middle top of the screen. And when you press select, um, it drops down and stuff like that. They don't have this in the game. They don't have it in here, so that's my only complaint. Um, I haven't played it with anyone else. I only played it solo on the gamepad, so. Uh, yeah, it's kind of like Super Mario Bros. 3 meets Super Mario World. Um, that's pretty much it. Nintendo Land. Uh, it's a pretty fun game. You kind of need to actually have people playing with you. Um, it's kind of similar to Mario Party, but um, I don't know. It's kind of fun just by yourself. But when you get at least another person, it's kind of fun as well. Um, playing some of the, the co-op games, I think it's called. Or just, you know, competitive games. So I know I haven't gotten time to playing this sadly enough uh, because I use <clears throat> an HD TV. It kind of makes um, when I put AV cables or use AV cables, it just it's just horrible. It just stretches out stretches out the video quality and just makes it horrendous. Um, same thing with Wayne's World. I haven't played it. Just well, that game's just pretty crappy, anyways. Uh, Double Dragon Three. I haven't gone down to playing. I just haven't cleaned it. That's pretty much why. Monster Party, same thing. Um, but it did happen to hear good things about this game um, by Gaijin Goma. He actually explained some of the cultural references of Japanese culture in that game. So definitely check out that video. 
uh, Paper Mario Sticker Star. Haven't gotten out of playing it super much, or most of it actually. I beat the being the first world, but I haven't beaten the second one. Um, you just have to go back and forth. This is pretty much one of those type of games. It's not really RPG related. You can find out. Uh, some of the stickers in the world you're in or the level you're in um, and that's pretty much how you attack and defend and stuff like that um, but it's, it's, a, it's a decent game it's not the best Paper Mario game in the whole franchise or series I should say uh, Pokemon White 2 I haven't gone down to playing this either um, the farthest I've gone is where the, the town is frozen and you know you have to fight that Team Rocket to that Generation Team Rocket um, I'm excited about Pokemon X and Y though, uh, so that's pretty much it, guys. These are my uh, games that I picked up in 2012 and didn't get to cover and stuff like that. This is a quick overview, pretty much. I couldn't have explained a lot, but I just wanted to cut it down in video time and stuff like that. So thanks for watching, guys, and I'll catch you guys later.